The global coal market has experienced significant fluctuations recently, influenced by geopolitical tensions, supply chain dynamics, and changing demand patterns. Increasing regulatory pressures in major coal-producing countries, along with natural disasters affecting mining operations, have complicated the supply landscape. For instance, tensions in Eastern Europe have disrupted coal shipments, resulting in rising prices in the affected regions. Additionally, many countries are transitioning to greener energy sources, influencing coal demand and contributing to market volatility. Seasonal demand fluctuations, especially during colder months, typically drive prices up, highlighting the importance of staying informed about these developments. European thermal coal prices have surged, reaching around 115 US dollars to 116 US dollars per ton. This increase is driven by lower inventory levels, forecasts of a significant cold snap, and rising gas prices amid escalating conflicts, particularly between Israel and Lebanon, and ongoing tensions involving Russia and Ukraine. Notably, exports from Colombia have risen by 40%, providing some counter-pressure to these price hikes. The decline in coal stocks at ARA terminals, which have fallen to 3.6 million tons, reflects the heightened demand for reliable energy sources amidst uncertainties in gas supply. In South Africa, the prices for high CV 6,000 coal have climbed above 107 US dollars per ton, rebounding from five-month lows. This rise is largely due to increased demand from India, which is recovering from its monsoon season and has experienced a 16% decline in renewable energy generation, resulting in a greater reliance on coal. However, demand from sponge iron producers remains below normal levels due to stockpiles and anticipated production cuts linked to weak steel prices. Turning to Mozambique, logistics company Grindrod has announced plans to repurchase a 35% stake in the Matola coal terminal from VTOL for $77 million. This strategic move aims to enhance the terminal's coal and magnetite handling capacity from 7.5 million tons per annum to 12 million tons. Such investments in infrastructure are essential for Mozambique as it seeks to strengthen its position in the African coal market and attract further investments. In China, spot prices for 5,500 net calorific value coal at the Qinhuangdao port have risen by 3 US dollars per ton, reaching 124 US dollars per ton. This price increase is attributed to strong demand in anticipation of the upcoming national holidays and lower production due to recent rainfall. The Chinese government has also introduced new economic stimulus measures, including lowering interest rates and investing in infrastructure projects, which may bolster coal consumption in the medium term. Meanwhile, Indonesian coal prices remain stable, with 5,900 gross as received coal priced at 92 US dollars per ton. This stability is supported by consistent demand from the Philippines and Vietnam, both experiencing increased electricity consumption. However, logistical challenges, such as low water levels affecting barge loading in critical rivers, may impact overall supply chain dynamics. Australian high CV 6,000 coal prices have surged to 140 US dollars per ton, supported by a rebound in demand across the Asia-Pacific region and monetary easing measures in China. This increase reflects rising demand for coking coal driven by infrastructure projects in various countries. As we look ahead, navigating the coal market will require stakeholders to remain vigilant and adaptable to the complexities of geopolitical tensions, energy demands, and weather conditions. Market fluctuations may arise from sudden changes in international trade policies or shifts toward renewable energy sources. Ongoing investments in infrastructure 
and innovations in carbon capture and storage could 